Hi guys, it's David from August University, just tuning in. It's been a few days since I uploaded a video. Just want to kind of touch base with you guys. It's going to be a couple of videos where I'm just going to be a little bit more laid back, chill, me not be screen sharing and just kind of talking with you guys. Um, it's been a little challenging to be honest with you. I've uh, been dealing with a lot of family stuff, pretty much stay at home dad right now uh, while balancing out my channel, my business, all that stuff, just kind of uh, helping my wife out as she's back to work. Um, and yeah, some a lot of things going on, another child on the way. So just overall craziness, but I'm here to support my family, here to, you know, be, stay positive as well. So I appreciate everyone watching the channel and being patient with me as things go on. Now, when it comes to, uh, you know the markets things like that it looks as if we are still pretty bearish um i recently picked up a little bit more hex um and i'm looking to accumulate a little bit more ethereum if possible but i don't know if it's gonna get any better by end of the year or if it's gonna kind of move uh early next year but we are bull so we are due for a, another bull run it should be the end of the bear market pretty soon, hopefully, but well, we, there's no guarantees of anything. My suggestion is dollar cost averaging into your favorite assets, whether it be Bitcoin, Ethereum, Hex, you know, whatever you feel is a project for you that is developing nice technology. Uh, Bitcoin, nothing really new there. It's the grandfather of crypto but I still believe Bitcoin has its value for sure. Ethereum has a lot of upwards momentum potential. I believe Hex as well. So just look at, you know, BNB is a good one. Just look at the cryptos that you believe are a long-term uh, asset that you think will have value in the future and dollar cost average in, okay? Um, otherwise, myself, I'm just trying to stay busy. I am doing a lot of learning as well right now with uh, studying. And it's just been a little bit tough to do it all, to be honest. You know, late nights. But we got to stay positive, right? It all starts with the mindset. So, uh, you know, we got to support each other here. And uh, if you guys need anyone to talk to or anything like that, I'm always here. Comment down below what you guys are up to in your journey, what you're doing during the bear market. Um, now for Hex, I am, like I said, accumulating more whenever I can. It's super low for price right now. Um, you know, I think we're at 0 0.048. I think that's Canadian actually, so it might be lower in US. Um, and when we get back to that, you know, 60 cent mark and then move towards the dollar again, we will. We just gotta be patient. Uh, and uh, it might take a year. But once we get past that dollar, two dollars, I think we're gonna we're gonna skyrocket uh, during the bull run, okay? So this is going to make a lot of us extremely wealthy. So we got to prepare for that wealth as well. So for now, while things are rough, what are you doing with your time? Right. What are you doing to fuel your mind, fuel your body? I've been working on uh, some personal health stuff, just trying to cut weight and things like that. Um, so I've been kind of just focused on, you know, counting calories, uh, I've been attempting, you know, keto as well, but I find I still mess up a few days, but for the most part, cutting out carbs. Um, and it has been working. I dropped about, um, about 10, 11 pounds so far, uh, over the last few months. So, uh, now biggest thing is, uh, workouts as well. I've been, uh, uh getting into the gym and doing more lifting and stuff like that. And honestly, it helps me with my mindset with stress as a father. Um, and just personal health uh, goals as well. So make sure you guys get out there, go and walk, get your workout in, um, do what you have to do to get your mindset right, right? So yeah, I just want to touch base with you guys today. I think the market's still gonna take a little while, it might take a few more months. Hopefully by end of Christmas, we're going into a reversal into the bull run. But if not, it could be a cold winter. It could be cold winter. So make sure that you accumulate um, more funds so that you can invest into what you believe in long term. Okay, this is not a this is not a quick race. This is a long term marathon, and 
he's gonna think about it that way. So if you gotta refresh, start over. I lost a lot of my Ethereum, I, I, unfortunately due to Celsius, uh, going bankrupt and stuff like that. And we don't know if we're gonna get things back. I know that they're working on things, recovery plan, etc. but I'm seeing that money, I'm, not to be negative, but as uh, you know, pretty much gone. You know, I had my daughter's, uh, you know, savings in there, unfortunately. It's just, it's just been rough. But that being said, I'm going to look at staying positive, keep grinding and uh, know that, you know, you know, not your keys, not your crypto. And Richard Hart actually mentioned that before. Didn't expect it from Celsius, honestly. But guess what? It happened. So, uh, you know, buy your assets, keep them off of exchanges, have your keys, have your own wallet, have full control, have full custody and stake hex that's all i can say all right so i appreciate everyone watching today's video tell me what you guys are up to during the bear market if you guys like cryptocurrency videos and personal health videos and make money online videos subscribe to the channel hit the like button on this video as well do i think that hex will still continue to gain momentum i think by next year we will get back to the alt, uh all-time high previous all-time high by early next year and I believe that we're gonna surpass that and then move towards that two, two to three dollar price range if we go into a bull market. If we don't go into a bull market, we're not gonna get there. All right, guys. Appreciate you guys. And, uh, you know, let me know what you guys are up to. And until next time, stay bullish. And I'll see you guys in the next video.